In this short video, we'll see how to upload an assignment to Turnitin. The first thing you need to do is go to the course in Blackboard and go to the section for which you can upload the assignment. So in this course, I've gone to the assessment section and chosen statistics assignment. There is an assignment brief with some details about the deadlines. There is an opportunity to upload into Blackboard some Excel files and if I scroll down, we'll see the Turnitin symbol. So here, this is where I can upload a draft submission to get some feedback and see the originality report for my draft prior to uploading my final submission. Here, we're going to just upload a file as the final submission. Click on View Complete, and this uploads or logs into the Turnitin uh, system. You should use Firefox or Chrome as Internet Explorer seems to give a problem. If we put our mouse over the information, this tells us that we should upload our final submission here and it gives us other instructions. This button, if it appears, is your rubric and if you click on this you'll see the marking scheme or the rubric that your lecturer will use to mark your work. So let's have a look at it and here we can see I'll just move it down so you can see it. It's the rubric for the statistics project and you can see the criteria here and the marking across the top. So this gives you a sense of how you're going to be marked. In order to then uh, upload your work, click on Submit. This will bring up your option to upload a single file. So your name will appear and you can't edit that. You can give your name a title, follow any instructions that your instructor gives you, your lecturer gives you. So I'm just going to call it um, assignment. And if we scroll down, you can choose to upload it from your computer, from Dropbox or Google Drive account if you have them. So we're going to upload it from the computer. And here I've already navigated to Joe's essay, the Word document that I want to upload. Click on open. And this allows us to upload the file. Click upload. And this can take a little bit of time depending on uh, how cl quick your internet connection is. So it gives us the information about the file and the details here, plus it gives us a visual preview. So this is in the new Turnitin submission. We get actual a full visual uh, preview of the document. At this point, you can confirm that this is the correct document that you want to upload to Turnitin and click confirm. So it's now going through process of submitting. So we now get a message saying we have completed our submission and this means that we have a submission. You'll get an email to your email account confirming that. Click on return to assignment list. If you come back at any point this is what you'll see. You'll see that it's already been submitted. You're able to view your work, you're able to download your work and you're also able to click on here to access your originality report. So clicking on this brings up your Turnitin document viewer and it will upload the assignment that's been there together with the originality report. The 100% is because I've just copied and pasted this from the college website. Okay, that's it.